Julie, what a finish. How's your heart? I have still not stopped shaking. I'm trembling like a leaf. I think it was just so exciting and I'm so proud of them. Talk us through your thoughts when Jo Harton had the goal, the ball under the goal ring and she was shooting for the match. I have to tell you, I had no doubt in the world that Jo would sink that shot. We've had lots of little chats lately about playing under pressure and that and there's no one I would rather have had the ball in their hands. What was the message at three quarter time? Because your side seemed to come out with a real sense of urgency and they were calm when they needed to be. Yeah, I think that was the thing. We've, in the past, we've let ourselves go by becoming too overexcited in the moment sort of thing. But today, we handled those critical moments quite well. And we knew we were doing that. And I think that gave us a lot of confidence. Sinclair at Wing Defence, you said you wanted her to come in and bring some enthusiasm and excitement. Did she bring that today? Yeah, I think she did. There were a couple of times I think she went missing. But for an 18-year-old kid, who's, this is only her second senior game in netball. So I think she did an amazing job. How did it feel for you today? You're back on your home soil coaching against your old side. What were the feelings like? Oh, look, it's just fantastic to win. And I do feel for the Swiss. I know how hard it is to get knocked out in a game like that. And I just think that Nepal, New South Wales and the Swiss do such an amazing job with these games that I do feel for them, but I'm pretty happy we won. <laughs> Brisbane or Melbourne next week, which side do you fear the most out of those two? I really don't care. I really don't care. I think we played well against the Firebirds last week and didn't handle a few things as well as we could have. And we've got a reasonably good record against the Vixens. We know that both of them are going to be extremely tough. We've got to beat them both if we're going anywhere. So we're just looking forward to it. A fantastic result today. Well done. Thanks very much, Sarah.